What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the vlog, my name is Eric. In today's video, we're going to be installing some upgraded pure stage two high flow turbos on my N54 powered BMW 535XI. Let's jump into it. Right, guys as you can see here we have the upgraded pure stage 2 turbos with the two inch snouts that are welded on these are a, a hybrid turbo so they have new center sections with the billet internal wheel new waste gates um, as well as new exhaust turbines and wastegate um, arms right there everything is new so these are supposedly capable of up to 700 horsepower so we're gonna be seeing how far we can push it this car currently is full bolt on with a stage 2 fuel pump we should be able to get somewhere in the slow 600s on a little bit of e85 so we're gonna be trying for that once we are able to get this thing custom tuned on the new turbos we'll start thinking about doing an upgraded fuel system which will let us completely max out what these turbos are capable of that's gonna be stuff like port injection as well as a bigger low pressure fuel pump and possibly some fuel lines. Some other stuff we're gonna be doing while we do the turbos is some maintenance. So we have a new oil pan gasket as well as the turbo install kit, oil pan bolts, differential seals, axle bolts, differential fluid, and some new engine mounts just to be safe. This is all gonna be going in the E60. So there should be a bunch of time lapses in this video. Hopefully you guys enjoy it and we'll be reviewing these turbos at the end. Work for that. I tell it work for that. I'm about to hurt for that. 
don't wanna hurt you, some wanna work it, don't wanna learn the task. I run around, do what I want, that's why I cop whatever I want, I get. Run around, dodging them cops, I tell them fuck off, no way they got me for that, I'ma charge for that. One's on, I'm just all in black, I got my fame and it's all for that. I need to fall in our back, God, I give it all for that. I been through hell and came back, back. Only worry about my racks, I'm on it and never look back. Shawty might get too attached, I'm on it and I feel like that That rich and never going back I'm falling, it's all that I have I'm all in my bag, wasn't supposed to do that I went through hell and came back, back Only worry about my racks I'm on it and never look back, back Shawty might get too attached I'm on it and I feel like that That rich and never going back I'm falling, it's all that I have I'm all in my bag, wasn't supposed to do that Now I buy shit I never could have had Now she want me, they never did want that Whatever we sit by, I'm more like my dad Living my heaven to hell with that I'ma get me done, don't worry, don't panic I came out it with like a titanic passenger Placement too busy for them to see traffic is havoc I'm living my life like a bachelor Run around, do what I want That's why I cop, whatever I want, I get Run around, dodging them cops I tell them fuck off, no way they got me for that I'ma charge for that One song, I'm dressed all in black I got my fame and it's all for that I need to fall in our back God, I give it all for that I do hell and came back, back only worry about my racks, I'm on it and never look back. Back, shawty might get too attached, I'm on it and I feel like that. That rich and never going back, I'm falling, it's all that I have, I'm all in my bag. Wasn't supposed to do that, I went through hell and came back. Back, only worry about my racks, I'm on it and never look back. Back, shawty might get too attached, I'm on it and I feel like that. That rich and never going back, I'm falling, it's all that I have, I'm all in my bag. Wasn't supposed to do that. See, this thing is up and running. It is absolutely perfect. It's not leaking anything. Um, we actually were able to get done, as you guys saw, the oil pan gasket. That did require a ton of other stuff to come out, including the entire subframe with the motor mounts, the front diff, which meant both the axles, all of the control arms, and everything else associated with the front end, like power steering and the steering rack, all had to come out to get that oil pan gasket out. Um, once that oil pan gasket was out and resealed, it actually gave me a ton more room to do the turbos because I already had everything out of the way. Um, but that was a huge pain. So I'm glad I was able to get that done and it is not leaking at all. We have no fluids going anywhere. Everything has been bled. Super stoked on how this turned out. Um, let's go get this alignment and then we'll be boosting. Alright guys, we're all finished up here. The alignment went great. Shout out to Clegg's Automotive. Um, we are going to be installing the port injector and starting our first base map of the custom tune tonight. Um, that is going to be in another video though. So if you guys enjoyed this one, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button to check out some more content, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.